I just moved here to New York and I love it. And you're from here, Hell's yeah, Kitchen, right? Yeah, just down the street. Can yeah. You it? Did you did you enjoy the city at all growing up? Do you like do you like no, the energy? No, I didn't because it was very rough back then. Yeah. Back then, it actually, it was called Hell's Kitchen for a reason. It's because at that time, a lot of different people lived in the neighborhood and they would cook because they're so hot. They would cook on the balconies. Yeah. So it smelled like Hell's Kitchen because you had cabbage with Is beans. That how it got the name? Yeah, that's I didn't that's know how that. the name came. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. You learn something yeah, new every day. Now you know. You're just bestowing knowledge left and right. Thank I like you. it. Well, in the in the documentary, like you talk about pain and regret, and that's like what the character is going through. But a lot of people relate to that. So how do you deal with pain or regret in your life? Well, you just have to say it's going to be there. It's never going to go away. Inevitable. And yeah. it, and I think you just understand you have to accept it. It's it's part of your history, part of your culture. And okay, I know it's going to arrive, but I'm prepared for it. And it will pass. Mm -hmm. It's like a bad storm. Yeah. It's just, but I think people become disillusioned when they go, oh, well, I sought medical help. I've seen a psychiatrist. And they think their history is going to vanish. And no. it doesn't, no. But in some ways, it can be a, a motivating force. Hell yeah. You know, even though it started like as a negative, it can eventually end up as a positive if, if you use it instead of internalizing it. Use it for fuel. Yeah, I think fire. so. Yeah. 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 But like what you do, you entertain people. And when you're being entertained is when you kind of forget your problems for two yeah. hours, three hours, you know what I mean? Why do you think I have nine jobs? <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, busy, busy, busy. <laughs> yeah. Funny. I do like being busy, though, and I think that is a thing from yeah. childhood. Like, I'm mm. like, okay, I must be productive in it. Not that it necessarily keeps it at bay, but I think it gives you a break to maybe get some perspective and listen oh, to absolutely. other people. And no, There's no question. I think... Yeah. Yeah, the more you keep yourself motivated, mm -hmm. the better off it is. Yeah. Um, I heard that you said Rocky couldn't have existed without Carl Weathers, no, right? No, I mean, you know, it, first of all, Rocky's a, oh, I know. Look at that boat, it's so iconic, wow. A, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, he was amazing. I couldn't find anyone to play the part. No one had all the tools. Either their voice was too high or they weren't big enough or they weren't athletic enough. It's really hard to find yeah. everything in a person. So it was about 8 o'clock at night, and the guy I wanted so that he quit because he wants to go on a bicycle race competition. I went, really? So obviously he was not a serious actor. Yeah. He was a physical type. So I'm sitting there, and at 8.30, this fella comes in, and he's mad. Like, what am I here for? I mean, because no one gets a, Like, you don't have an audition at 8.30 at night. You're, like, at the bottom of the barrel, you know what oh. I mean? You know what I mean? It's like I didn't noon, know that. lunch, okay. you know, it's like 8.30. Uh. So he comes in, they pulled him off a plane going to Oakland. So he's coming in and he's fired up. All right, what do I do? I go, voice good, voice is good. <laughs> go check that. He goes, and he takes his jacket off, <laughs> shoulders forever. Check. <laughs> check, <laughs> and then he looked, I went, Good looking. You know, yeah. Nice. I didn't expect that, you know, because he's a boxer. Tough. And then we start, and tough. Then we started to get up, I'm telling you. And he goes, pow, pow, pow. I was, damn. It's like a, <laughs> it's like a woodpecker hit me. Oh my God. Check. And then he goes, I would have done better if you at least hired a real actor instead of, uh, what do you, what's this guy do? Work in the office? I go, no, he's Rocky. It was, all right, how you doing, Rock? He's like, there was... And I go, this guy arrogant, is... got it. <laughs> but you need it, office. you know what I mean? I, yeah. wanted that. I wanted him to have this, like Muhammad huh. Ali. Uh. He had it all. He had charm, he had this, he had hard ass soul. So I, I was stunned when it happened. I was like yeah. crushed. I didn't think he would ever die. You know, he's yeah. like Superman. Yeah. Yeah. So I look back now with fond, fond, fond memories because it's never going to happen. You know what happens? You have those seminal moments, those crossroads. Yep. It's like and certain chemistry on certain it things. Just, yeah, it's impossible to duplicate. Yeah, you know, it's yeah. like if they take a group, and let's say the Rolling Stones, right? You take Mick Jagger out, it's over. Yeah. You take Mick Jagger as a solo, I don't think it works either. There's it's something like that. about that combination that was so unique that you can't you can't mess with it. Yeah. And I think that happened with Rocky. Everybody in it was like sort of born to play the part. Yeah. Hey. I love it. And when it works out like that, that's why it's so successful. Yeah, yeah. it is. It is. His Netflix documentary is called Fly. And a new season of his Paramount Plus.
series, The Family Storm, starts February 21st. The show also stars his family, so everybody, let's welcome them right now. Please say hello to Scarlett, Sistine, and Sophia Stallone, and their mama, Jennifer Flavin Stallone. <laughs> It, like, no one unattractive is allowed in your family. <laughs> like, the whole damn family is attractive. Oh, it's oh, amazing. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Makes my life very Beautiful. hard. Beautiful, yeah. yes. Thank well, you. your life is already hard. I'm looking at four women that you had in your house for many years. <laughs> <laughs> that couldn't have been easy. But speaking of, like, home life, um, y'all just moved to Florida. Yes. Yeah. Oh, we love it. Why, I love why it. the move? Because our older two daughters moved to New York, yep. and then yep. our younger daughter goes to college in Florida. So oh, we they thought... They follow us everywhere. We couldn't, I I, you know, it was such a long flight, so we just thought it we'd is. move a little closer. Yeah, <laughs> I didn't really realize that until I have to go to LA for things, and I'm like, oh my That's, god, yeah. it's a five yeah. and a half hour, I am six not hour flight. Twenty anymore. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I was like, what? Um, what do you do? You like when they come visit in New York? Do you like? Yeah. No. Oh. <laughs> oh no. No. I'm gonna be honest. I'm gonna be honest. She, she said no. She goes, yeah, no. no. Don't be vague. Look, I don't want to lie. I don't want to <laughs> lie on your show. Okay. I don't want to lie. My mom, love her, she's OCD with cleanliness, and my dad tries to fix things. For example, we had a lamp with no light bulb, so we unscrewed another lamp to put it in this one, and then that one had no light bulb. So he yeah. tries to help. Well, wait, did you not use the other one? Is we that used, why? We used all of them. All of them oh. But he makes things a little more yeah, difficult. Uh, excuse me. Okay. It's on you guys. No. Two light bulbs. It's really easy. Go buy more light bulbs. That's That's right. Right. All right, so you live with a lot of women, man. So, like, did you have, like, a man Lucky thing? guy, lucky guy. Lucky guy. Yeah. yeah. But did you have a just a corner for you? I did. Or, okay. I, I did for about ten minutes. And oh, then it became oh, please. a bear oh, cave. Please. Oh, no. please. You guys, he cave. had his man cave. He had a big office where he'd write. He had another man cave where he'd sit no, and watch it's it's boxing. A, it's a he no, took over the entire garage and so made it an art know. studio for him. So our cars well. were in the front yard, and he would just like paint in the garage. Trust me, he was oh fine. Oh my god, he was fine. they are such liars. It's un <laughs> <laughs> it's unbelievable. This is the I'm best the television. Yeah. Your show is oh amazing. Oh my god, <laughs> Pinocchio, all of it. Pinocchio. <laughs> oh my god, I love it. I love cut to us having footage of like exactly what they're saying. Yeah. 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 So wait, so you have a very athletic dad. So did he like play sports? Oh, like, oh yeah. Oh, we did every. Seven sport in high school, every single one. Oh. The scene broke the record for shot put. My dad thought before school, and this is true, every morning for about four years, he'd wake us up early, we'd have to do push-ups, sit-ups, swing a golf club, throw a shot put. I don't know why shot Fox? put, that was Yeah, that was, that was But he said the thing. only two things he wanted us to do in life was know how to swing a golf club and know how to throw a shot put. And I'm not sure what the yeah. second one was about. We were top shot putters Listen, in our it, it got, got, I'm not sure why. It got it got they can, you guys can throw a punch, too. Yeah. Yeah, oh, yeah, they get hit hard. Now that's a good oh, thing to teach them. You might need that one day. Yeah, never know. Not every guy's the right guy. Um, so, <laughs> did you ever give them any like mottos to like live by? Any advice, especially uh, with dudes? Oh, oh well, yes. I actually, I, did. I said, think like a man. Okay. And act like a woman, and you'll figure it all out. You okay. Know, it, because we're not that complicated. Okay. Oh. I mean, no, all you <laughs> seriously. We just, my wife makes me watch the housewives of everywhere. Yeah. Okay. And I went, wow, you, we have no chance. No. Yeah. I mean, women are just active. They, I don't know that you should necessarily compare most of the women in the world to no, the people. No, 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 no. Yes, I yeah. can. I don't know if that's. No, no. What it is is you guys have such command of the language. I mean, you activate, you talk. Men just can sit there at a football game. Go, How you doing? How you doing? And that's it. Oh, it's three yeah. hours. Right? No, now I'll tell you this, <laughs> yeah, man. Right? I went to the Super Bowl one time. This clown's talking to me the whole time, and it was a dude. And yeah. I was yeah. like, yeah. I did not come here to meet you. Yeah. Well, then, I was like, so I'm different. watching the game. So some of us, just saying. Yeah, you have a couple us. friends that never stop talking, Sly. You fall asleep and go to bed, and you leave stuck us. with and I us. Stuck <laughs> That's, that's me. I would leave. I'd be I like, leave, it's I time go. for bed and sneak upstairs. <laughs> I've actually called the police a couple of times. <laughs> to be like, go for home. Noise. I go, there's a lot of noise coming from the Stallone house. And the cops will show up. And I'm upstairs in the bedroom watching a Western. You're <laughs>
<laughs> so wait, I, I, I got it. Okay, Sistine, so you, is this a true story? Uh-oh. Um, did your father like throw you into sharks at some point in your life? Oh See, it sounds crazy and unfortunately- Well, it sounds like someone should have called true. child services, but yeah. yeah. Fair <laughs> enough, it's true. It was a controlled environment, so it was very safe. Okay. Swimming with the sharks experience. And uh, my dad, I was seriously afraid of them. He thought it'd be funny to throw some chum in my one piece and shove me right in. And she's also and, a horrible swimmer. And I'm a bad swimmer, so it was just a really, I, I, I don't think I talked to you the rest of the trip. I was no, very didn't. upset. Oh my God. Yeah. I wanted to see if the sharks bite. No, you did not. <laughs> I got two other daughters. I got two other daughters. Yeah. Thank you. The fact okay. that he was like, you know I'm going to put chum in there. I know. <laughs> well, now I know where I stand on the leader. I know, you're right. <laughs> Yeah. Have you gotten them back? I did something a little naughty. Um, first little. season, I pretended I was pregnant. Can you imagine? I, I did. On camera. I mean, on camera, <laughs> so it, you know. She made a birthday cake with all these goofy baby No, but parts. by the way, Kelly, it was my mom's idea. So that was, I was, I was that. It was funny. my mom's yeah, idea. I like baby your parts, stuff. like. You know, I actually thing, like, thought he was gonna have a heart attack. And yeah, I say, like Freddy Krueger. By the way, it was on his birthday. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I love your women so much and I, your family. Yeah. <laughs> we gotta dish it back. You know? I know. Yeah. You threw her into sharks with chum. I did. <laughs> like, I'm like, you, she gets like five more things. Thank you. <laughs> like, that's Thank horrifying. You. you guys kept saying, oh, they don't bite. I go, it's a shark. Maybe you have one there has emotional problems. By the way, problems. we all got in the water. <laughs> Guess who stayed on the boat the whole time? For sure. He did not push. For sure. Sure. He didn't put his toe in the water. We all swam with them the you whole time. You can have the water. I'm staying on the land. The shark, you know what I mean? I'm <laughs> up already. What were your, like, initial thoughts? Because this is letting people in your lives. So what were your initial thoughts about this? I think we all were a little nervous. And yeah. we are all thinking, oh, my God, are people going to like us, hate us, and make fun I of us? I the idea. Yeah, he And then I go, it. oh, is that a close-up of me? <laughs> <laughs> Damn, I'm That's handsome. True. <laughs> That's true. Now it's like, we can't get him off the camera. I'm like, aren't you tired of being in front of the camera? It's like, very addictive. A it's, little just... bit. it's addictive. It's a, it's a burden and a, and a love. It's, it's, I love it. It's, it's a, a blessing and a curse. Yeah. yeah. What, what about y'all? What about being like What about you, Scar? Scar? Well, I was really nervous to do it, but I know Sophia and Sassine really wanted to do it because of their podcast, and then they love like talking to people and connecting with them, so they were yeah. like, might as well just bring the whole family in and just start a show. Yeah, you can't stop us from talking. We are always yeah. talking. We oh thought it'd be God. fun to include our family because we're different. This is like a very unorthodox kind of family with why would we do a reality show? Like, we don't really need to, but we're all pretty funny here and we love like how much love we show. And we think, oh, why don't we just film it for like a whole movie? <laughs> just just <laughs> for the, the world stuff to see. your dad does to you is worth the <laughs> yeah, television. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, 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 we were like, normal. Yeah, exactly. It's, now, see, I say this. My friends think I'm nuts, but I'm always like, prepare yourself. Like, oh, you're walking home when? Well, buddy system, like, yeah. I am constantly yeah. mothering all my no, friends. You have no idea. No, he, he's like, waits up for them. Yeah, I said, and he'll call them and say, you know, you're supposed to be home by 1130. And they're like, we're coming home. And he's no. like, no, no, you need to be in the car at 11, yeah. so you're in your bed at 1130. There's no, like, walking. See, that's no. different. Oh, Oh. Really shook them up, every one of them. I can't. I, mean, every, I was bad. He was bad. I was like, crushed their I hands. It was terrible. I hate it for you. Like, yeah. well, I can't even imagine bringing a dude uh -huh. home oh, no. to that. I would sneak them around the, like different doors of the yeah, house. Like, she was the boyfriend's friends. She'd always find uh -huh. a way to help us out, like yeah. so we could actually have a relationship, like, like have a real life. <laughs> and I, mean, the only I one saw nine guys walking upstairs and go, "Excuse me." <laughs> Okay. Got, it's bad enough there's one. Was that no, like no, the no. Bachelor? No, no, no. Oh, no. Like no. no. They had nine guys coming up to the room <laughs> and, and our cavapoos. <laughs> Hold but, on. But they I said, on, I'll included. say. No, they, no, were, no, no. they were like 13 years but old. But listen, no, but I said vacation, I had all my friends over. They're making it sound like I was alone movie. with nine men no, in my room. No, I said, Sly, you saw all these boys walking up to her bedroom. And I said, Sly, nine is better than one. Hell go, yeah. It's no, it ain't. <laughs> no. It's, it's nine times the problem. Oh. So I hold the door, I put furniture against it, they can't close the door. Uh -uh. And oh, that's, there and, has to be an open door policy. And blare that television. Yeah. yeah, it was an open door policy. I mean, yeah. Uh, oh my yeah. God. Oh yeah. oh yeah, are you kidding me? That must yeah. be so hard. And you know, every dude is just like, I'm sorry, your, your dad is who? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like, oh, exactly. I don't... Wait, so this new season, speaking of boys, this new season is about um, a boyfriend, right? It's yes. like a lot of it is about, yeah. Yeah, so basically, 
my boy, my new boyfriend and I, Louis, he comes into the picture and I remember bringing him over for the first time to film. And he's never been over to my house or anything like that. So he walks in, there's five cameras on him. Oh. And he goes, oh God. <laughs> <laughs> he comes in, there's five cameras on him. And he goes, what a family. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, well you warned him, right? I, kind of, but it, you know, it's... <laughs> <laughs> I didn't want to scare him it's off. It's better if you don't say anything. Yeah, it's better if you just let it happen. I just yeah, didn't want to scare yeah. him off. I like him too much. And Aww. they like him too. He's a Especially him. Sly. Boy. Especially Sly. You like right, him a lot. Sly. That's what you like. like him. He's a good kid. <laughs> Do I have a it's choice? The one time you've been quiet. <laughs> I know. No, I. Yeah. I do like him. I like him. Nice hair. Thank you. <laughs> good guy. Very nice. Please, oh whenever he comes over, you steal him away from me. I will say, I don't know if any, well, he does that on purpose, so he's not with you. <laughs> That's, <laughs> That's so true. So true. But I, I, I don't know, I think like, for parents in general, it's hard to see anyone worthy of this kid that you love. Yeah. That's, right. So it's, it's hard. It's love. It can appear controlling sometimes, but it is love. <laughs> All right, well, give it up for the Stallones, my new favorite show on television. Season two of their Paramount Plus series, The Family Stallone, starts February 23rd.